Hi, I'm Matt Davey. Today I'd like to show you the OSBN frame, which is a frame that I use uh, for a method called opening the sides of the brood nest. This is a partial frame of foundation and uh, we place it on the outside edge of the brood nest to trigger comb building. So here's an example of one that's uh, previously been built and drawn out by the bees. Uh, you can see that uh, the foundation uh, is in a wedge shape and we have these gaps on the bottom corners and these are drawn out as drone comb typically because the bees focus is on reproduction and raising drones. Uh, you can see the this uh, oval shape there of the brood nest where the brood has been and we have this shape here so that the majority of it is made as worker comb and only a small amount is made as drone comb. So let's uh, work on the plastic foundation now uh, with that. So we'll take some wax from last year uh, that's been rendered and we'll just rub this into the, the plastic foundation to create a coating on it. Now we've finished uh, coating the plastic foundation with wax. The reason we do that is because the bees are very reluctant to draw out plastic foundation. You'll see uh, some people will dip the foundation in wax or they'll paint it on. Uh, but I find if you just rub it on and then put it out in full sun, the black plastic will heat up and the wax should melt. And so this will help um, the bees draw out this foundation. So now we're going to cut off um, the bottom corners into the wedge shape and we'll do that now. So it's about uh, 215 millimeters or eight and a half inches. So just measure halfway down the bottom of this foundation and then we'll cut that with a sharp knife and we want to leave a bit of a tab um, on each so that it'll actually fit in the bottom groove of the frame as well. So now we'll just leave about five mils and we want to leave five mils on on the top as well um, just so we do when we do the second frame um, that will fit into the frame as well. So we'll just score that a few times Score that a few more times. Like that. Okay, so we'll leave that one there. So now we'll uh, cut the other uh, corner off. So just make sure you have a firm grip and because uh, it is a bit slippery and we just score that a few times. So now just bend it so that like that and it comes off quite easily. Okay so now we uh, get our frame and we want to just slot it in and again just push it in like that. So now that is our OSBN frame. That's what the OSBN frame looks like and uh, I suggest that you label it so that you can uh, find those frames a lot easier later on. Because you do have the, uh, the big gaps and it's filled with drone comb, uh, some people really don't like having a lot of drones in their hive, uh, so you may want to cut those out later. So it makes it uh, finding these frames a lot easier if they're labelled. 
All right, let's move on to the second frame and we'll show you what to do with that one. With the second frame, we have these uh, two pieces and they can be uh, a bit floppy if you just put them in uh, straight like that. But uh, we'll give that a go. Find which way to put them in. So see how they're flopping around like that? So you may want to glue those together because see how it's flopping? So what we'll do is we'll put some glue in the top and let that dry. Okay. So just uh, get a line of, of glue and we'll go that way. So remember to put these in upside down because your frame's upside down. And then you just line them up so that the hexagons are the right spacing apart. And then leave those to dry. So that's it. Uh, that's the two OSBN frames you make from one sheet of foundation. And we use those uh, when we're doing the uh, manipulations uh, for the opening the sides of the brood nest and so you use one at a time and it's the first two manipulations so uh, use one of the OSBN frames and one standard foundation and you put one on each side of the brood nest which is on the outside edge of the brood nest and that will encourage the bees to build um, new comb and uh, it helps to prevent swarms. Here is a close-up of the OSBN frame with the drone comb. You can see that uh, you have the worker comb on the plastic foundation and then the drone comb is being built in the empty spaces there. So OSBN is about maintaining two frames per box where, which are either empty or um, new foundation. and uh, it's about moving honey up and out of the brood nest and then placing those two new frames on each side of the brood nest. So they're right on the, the outside edge of the brood nest. And we do that throughout swarm season. And that is done or checked every two weeks. And then once uh, the swarm season is finished and we're into the main flow, then we only focus on the supers and maintaining two empty combs or two uh, new frames in each of the supers from then on.